Hey there, Empower of 5 meteorologist Trent McGill. We're going to talk about bow echoes, straight line wind damage producing thunderstorms. Typically, they don't start out and just automatically have strong straight line winds. They'll start out as unorganized, scattered storms, a super warm, super wet atmosphere, a lot of fuel. All they need is something to just kind of trigger that storm development. Very unorganized. Once you get a wave, cold front, a gust front, something to kind of focus these storms on. They'll get a bit more organized and they'll start to form a, a, a line. Essentially, that's when you start to get them rapidly strengthening, rapidly intensifying damage possible. So severe thunderstorm warnings possible with these. Something we got to keep an eye on, though, is on the back side of it. Those upper level winds will kind of wrap in on the bottom side of that. These storms are tall, so the upper level winds will get forced downward and that downward forcing will push the leading edge of that out. You see that that right there, that kind of backward C, it's called a bow echo. It bows out and that is a good indication that you've got some strong straight line winds pushing the leading edge of that 60 plus miles per hour, knock power out knock trees down can really do some damage. So whenever we start to talk about bow echoes, you know, we've got a shot. It's strong straight line winds potentially producing damage. I'm power five meteorologist Trent McGill. Let us know if you have any questions.